Hey everyone, Basic MTB here with another five minute or less tool review. Today we're looking at the Pro Bike Tool Mini Pump. This comes in three different styles. This one is the premium version, which has rounded off ends and nicer caps. There is a classic version and a version with a gauge. Functionally, they're all the same thing. They're all solid aluminum with a nice grippy texture and they all have a strain release hose. And the reason why I wanted a pump that has a hose is I'm running tubeless. And if you're running tubeless, you wanna make sure you to not tweak that valve stem because that'll cause air to leak or at worst case, you could snap the valve completely off. The way this works, the hose comes out the end, it threads into the opposite end and depending on if you have a straighter or pressed a valve, uh, that determines which end you thread in. This can fit both Strata and Presta, which is a big, um, big perk of this particular model, meaning you don't have to carry that little adapter anymore. So you simply screw this in, thread this end onto the valve, and then you're good to go. It's pretty easy to use. Um, the version with the gauge, the gauge goes from 20 PSI to I think 120 PSI. Uh, the reason I didn't go for the gauge one is it's, first of all, it's a bit larger. It's about two or three inches longer. And with the gauge starting at 20 PSI, I usually run my tires somewhere between uh, 20 to 30. So that's just not fine enough um, increments of measurement to really make use of that gauge. And once you've been biking for a while, you can generally just know by feel uh, what your tire pressure should be and if it's too high or too low. Um, so I opted for one that's a bit uh, smaller. In any case, I will put a link to all three in the description. Um, also check out basicmtb.com for more gear reviews, as well as uh, some cool stuff that I'm working on building at home. Um, that's it. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.